hello everyone so this is dinesh so in this video i am going to show you about google my business so obviously you are going to learn the google my business tutorial um, i am going to create on google my business profile for one of the website and show you like how to get it verified and optimize it for, uh, to perform well in the google search results so let's get started so i'm just going for uh, going to google my business just search for google my business and uh, land on this website so here you can uh, create the new business listing for your business so what i'm going to do is that uh, here there will be an option called manage now but uh, we are going to create new business so i'm going to sign in with uh, my gmail i'm just going to click on sign in so basically you need to either have the gmail uh, to create this google my business profile so actually i'm going to uh, create a new business profile for this website so this is one of the cl uh, client website so we have got this domain rubbish london and uh, hosted in Seekhost app and like uh, we have designed this site using uh, developer set click to and we are going to uh, now i'm going to create google my business profile for this website so i'm just this is the brand name going after it's a keyword targeted brand name so i'm just going to give us rubbish removal london so this is the brand name so you can see it, it asks for like create a business with this name so this is what i'm going to do so i have created the like I, i'm in the first step now of creating the google my business profile so now what i'm going to do is that i'm going to select need to select the category for this so this is a rubbish removal niche so we can have the category like waste clearance company waste collection service or let me say if we have rubbish removal this would be the best option so i'm just going to select it and so it uh, in the name the next step to last whether you need to have the location for this business so uh, this depends on your business in case if you are having the online e-commerce store then you may not have the physical location but in this in our case like this company has a physical location so i'm just going to give uh, yes this location for you so i'm going to select this as and so in the next step we will be uh, adding the address so here this company is located in uk so i'm just going to uh, add the details now come address details so this needs to be proper so since uh, i this is the address i have already saved it here so city is london and postcode is this is the postcode w1w5pf so i'm just going to select this and click on next so you can see there are already a lot of uh, some more some other companies in this business i mean uh, near to this address so it's a google prompts like whether uh, we are related to that company so we are not we are going to create as a new thing so i'm just going to ignore this and uh, select as one of these so uh, you provide deliveries or home or not actually this depends this also depends on your uh, business so since this is a rubbish removal niche we will be visiting the clients customers uh, place and we will be offering the service so uh, i'm going to select the uh, as yes so you can let them link to go so i'm just going to select this as yes so these are service areas you can add it as optional so i'm just going to give it as london at the moment later uh, we can add new places so it asks for the contact number so this is the contact number i'm going to add and the website url this is the website url so basically having the proper optimization uh, like it will help for help the customer to discover your business in a better way so literally we are in the final stage of creating this profile so the, this is not not much complicated it's very simple uh, you can have uh, you can just put you need to put the enter the business details properly what google is asking for so this is the email address which we have, we have created so I, google will send the verification code now so I'm, I am already having the email logged in. So I'm going to go to the email and just select the get the verification code from Google. So the two one zero seven eight. So this is the verification code. So you can because you need to Google need to uh, uh, confirm you like you are a real business owner of this 
particular business and uh, so you google will ask for some uh, verification purpose like this this time they have sent the code to email in some cases they will send the code directly to your postal address and you need to enter here to get verified so you can see like google is telling like you are now verified so i'm just going to now click on next and uh, i am into the website sorry the web uh, profile of the google my business so now you can just uh, add more services and optimize this profile so so far in this video you have learned like how to create a google my business profile now i'm going to show you like how to optimize the google my business profile in a perfect way uh, to uh, rank it on the google search results so we can add more so services i'm going to add custom services like even uh, these are the suggestions so i'm going to select these services because we are offering this also uh, i am going to actually these are already selected even uh, we can add new services like Even you can add this uh, later also, but uh, you should be capable enough to add all the services you are uh, actually planning to offer. So this asks for the operating hours of the business. So actually we are, this business runs 24 by 7, so I'm just going to select all these things and click on next, uh, it's asked for the times. So I'm just going to give us 24 hours since they are offering the service 24 by 7 in London. So because you need to make the profile perfect so only then the customers can uh, able to find it properly so it's as for the description So here you can see like there's a trick here so while adding the description i have just tried to add keywords here so you can see rubbish removal waste clearance junk removal i have embedded all these keywords so even you can make the description more brief So I just give a small description for now and I'm just going to move on to the next step. So it asks for the photo of your business. So basically we have the, I'm going to just add the logo for now. Even later you can optimize these things, but it's always uh, better to have these things perfect. I have just added the logo even if, uh, if your business is uh, about like maybe interior design company or those kind of things then you need to add more uh, pictures so that the customers should be more uh, attractive when they see your uh, profile so you can see it shows like uh, literally we have completed all the steps in the google my business profile uh, tutorial uh, so i'm just going to go to the final step so that's it so actually like within five minutes of time from the scratch we have completed creating the google my business profile for a rubbish removal uh, website in uk so this is uh, very simple but still there are a lot of things to be optimized to make it better and perform well on the google search results so let me take you one by one so first is the info about your business so basically i have added all the things in the while creating the profile itself but still i'm going to show you a small quick recap so uh, you can just have a uh, good idea like uh, how, how to make it better so you can see the uh, 
business name is rubbish removal london now i'm going to still optimize this name so i'm going to have have more keywords uh, to target here so obviously this is the brand name rubbish removal london but still i'm going to have the keywords in the uh, title to make it uh, more discoverable for the users so i'm just having like waste so in this case you can see like i have covered all the literally all the rubbish removal related keywords in this title so basically i have even if user searches for rubbish collection company rubbish clearance company rubbish removal uh, company all these are covered in this title tag i have given rubbish removal london waste clearance and collection company so ideally like different combinations will apply, apply here when user tries to search from different perspective so this is how you like you need to give the title so luckily our brand name itself has the keyword so that's the big positive for this uh, thing so this is the address so service areas even you can add more if you need So uh, you can add more service areas if you need like but at the moment I'm just going to leave because I need to do some research to find the best cities so at the moment I'm just going to leave it as London so that is the main city we are focusing on central London so the, the, that is done so our uh, service hours is done and also this is the phone number so if you have any products in case if you are a e-commerce site you can add here service wise I have already added here some services still you can add more if you need like so actually even here you can uh, add the prices as well so at the moment i'm just going to add show you for one small uh, one service so because if you I do for all these service it will take time so i'm just going to do it for this essential waste clearance and i'm going to uh, give it as price starting price may be from 50 sorry 100 pounds so I will, later I will confirm this with client and update it So this is given so if you like can see for this essential waste clearance we are offering services from 100 pounds so and i'm just giving the small description so i'm just saving it similarly you can add uh, the price for all these services uh, so like customers before contacting you they like they will have an, a rough idea about the pricing what you are offering so there will be no uh, like uh, confusion in later in the thing so this is done so we already added the website so that is fine so ideally like we have given everything uh, in, for this rubbish removal uh, related uh, google my business profile uh, we have given like uh, all the optimization done properly so the main thing while creating the google my business profile you, you should try to have the keywords in the title in the best optimal way on the other hand you should not stuff the keywords too much so that's the main thing so this is done so in this video hopefully i hope like you have learned like how to create a google my business profile from the scratch get it verified and optimize it perfectly uh, to perform well on the google search results so if you have any questions you can just drop it in the comment section uh, even i can able to cover it in the upcoming videos thank you